what's going on everybody this is a video that is um, a trade video uh, but it's also kind of like a I guess a video game update because that's what I got in the trade in the link in the bottom you'll see Scott Slasher World go sub the brother from another mother um, we did a deal uh, with um, a uh, Michael Jordan figure that I bought at a yard sale a little over a year ago probably and um, I've got some other starting lineups and stuff in my collection and they're they're like I like the ones from like 88 I'm trying to get most of them and stuff and um, it was from 91 or 92 I believe he showed it in his last video but I'm gonna put the uh, link to that video uh, go sub the brother and uh, give him a thumbs up and uh, share his videos do all that other stuff uh, but <clears throat> he mentioned in the video that I will be showing what I got from him and yes, you know, I'll end up having to do that. So this is the trade and a video game update. Okay, first up, uh, let's drop something. Okay, um, as you know, over the last few updates that I have had, I've got stuff like um, I got a 64 now and I had a PlayStation 1. Um, GameCube I've already had from a, uh, I bought off of a buddy of mine, uh, an Atari 2600. Now I've already had games for the 2600, uh, but Scott uh, bought a big bulk off of somebody, and um, he had a few of them that I wanted, so uh, I decided to go through his box and get the ones that I wanted. Now some of these are a little, uh, little dirty. I wiped them off and cleaned them, but uh, not from. Uh, you know him having them or whatever it was from uh i guess years and years of play or whatever so but the first one's cubert didn't have this one in the collection i remember playing this with my cousin back in the day quite a bit on the atari really cool to add that one to um the atari i got a, quite a few already too um video pinball that's a really cool one this one's really clean too probably not too many people played this one probably or something but um, yeah, that one's that one, and uh, this one's probably the the wore out one out of all of them. But I mean, you can always find these things pretty cheap places, so I might get another one, or maybe they make repo stickers now. But uh, Pitfall, because I like to keep my stuff pretty pristine, you know, condition and stuff. So um, I'm picky like that. So yeah, it's it's had its uh, day uh, of reckoning. Uh, this one, Space Invaders, a real cool one I remember back in the day too, growing up. Love that one. Uh, Grand Prix. This one's even got crayon mark across it. I couldn't get it, so this stuff's probably been on her since the 80s, I don't know. This one's kind of wore out too, but uh, this is Frogger. <laughs> Pretty bad uh, picture on this one. Uh, but uh, what you gonna do with some of these old games? And Chopper command that is all of the 2600 games that i picked up from him um and then he had a 7800 he had a few 7800 and i don't even have a system for that but i said you know who knows one day hitting the yard sales flea markets i might find one so i picked this one up off of him i miss pac-man uh, most of these are really clean too so yeah, I've got a 7800. Don't even have the system. Well, there's a few other ones I'm gonna show you here that I don't even have a system. Uh, this is, um, what's this one called? Super Black Bass. This is a Super Nintendo. I don't even have one of these yet, but I've got about five or six games so far. Uh, picking up stuff here and there in the last, well, few months, I guess. Um, he said, I don't I don't like fishing. Well, I said, I don't either, but hell, I'll, I'll take it anyway. And you know, I might fish on the on a video game, but I don't go out real fishing or whatever. So that's an ad there. Uh, he had two NES games that I wanted. This is NES Open. It's got Mario on the front of it. Don't have a, a regular Nintendo either, so I'm gonna have to get one of them. I talked about getting a Retron 5 before, but with the old TV that I have, uh, I think them are all, all um, HDMI, so in case I put another TV in here or something down the road, I don't know. But uh, since I've already got, you know, what, five systems already here, might as well get, you know, Super Nintendo and the Nintendo. I still got a few spots, uh, spots, a few slots down here in the cube. 
but uh, this one's pretty cool. I, I don't think I've ever played it. Uh, and then I just threw this one in too. I was like, hell, this is another one he had. And he had a few other ones and he didn't want to get rid of. He had Jackal. I'd love he got that one. But uh, he, he wanted to keep it. Super Spike V-Ball World Cup. Nintendo World Cup. So that's another ad. I've got a, quite a few of the regular Nintendos. And uh, my very first 64 game, WWF Attitude. That's a little war on the picture and stuff. Uh, it did have a sticker on it, but I, I took it off and everything, cleaned it up. Uh, so now I have my first 64 game since I bought the uh, system uh, off a buddy of mine. So now I've got, um, I got at least one game to play on that one. Still got to get a Nintendo and a Super Nintendo. But that is uh, it for the trade. Uh, I've got quite a bit of stuff. You know, I paid like 30 bucks for that um, uh, Jordan figure. It was in the case. It was in the in the package. And they had a protector case over it. He wanted to try to give me more, but I was like, yeah, that's that's pretty good, I'd say. Because, you know, most games that I've got for Atari, I paid no more than two or three bucks. I got some off of uh, Jason and Spookables. And these other games ain't worth a whole lot, but, you know, it's still good. This is what I probably would have ended up getting out of them anyway. So, uh, yeah, go check him out. I'll put the link in the bottom. Check out Scott Slasher World. Check out his video and all the other stuff that he picked up in the video, plus the Michael Jordan figure that I traded him. And that's it for this video. This is Movie John, and I'm always filming.